you think it really can be a confidence builder? I think it can build your confidence um, when you see how, you know, how many people actually would be interested in meeting you and for, for whatever purpose. Um, but, uh, but I, you know, I, I think everyone does get, in the end, infected by that, that sense that while there are limitless possibilities out there, there, there's an endless army of people that, you know, there's a stream of people that was never going to end. So how do you then decide to stick with someone and think, okay, well, I, right, I'm, I'm, I'm out of here. I'm deleting this, this app. I'm not on, I'm on anymore because I found the one. But, you know, in the back of your mind, there's always, well, you know, there's loads more people out there. And, I mean, it's, it's really easy to, to get back on it at any time and, and find someone who is maybe a bit better or if this is a little disappointing. Well, you know, it's really easy. You, you don't have any sense of you've really got to commit yourself to someone. Um, when it's so easy to, you know, just move on again. Um, so that, 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 to me, is, is the downside. I mean, they say a lot of people get married now who meet uh, on, on dating sites um, and I find that really amazing because you've got to both decide simultaneously that you, you're both going to commit yourselves to each other and sort of forsake everyone else and, and not go back on those apps and those dating sites anymore and you know to, to both reach that point at the same moment well you know it's, it's not easy in this day and age. But Ken how did you do?